Realistic jewels with a Roshi. There are no indicators for this, so this could be tricky. <laughs> that was risky. That's we got him. Round two. I wonder if we can get any deflects or parries. Yes, we can. But we traded with him. Oh, I traded again. If I'd have managed to get that deflect, then that would have killed him. What is going on? His uh, sword has got a mind of its own. Defeat. Right, we can get him next time. Well, we know we can deflect without an indicator, which is interesting. Round three. I think probably parrying is better though, because he can just get us with his heavy afterwards. Victory. Ah, thankfully our zone got him. Deflecting lights with no indicators. Round four. A new form of a Rochi Jules. Parried. Oh. And that is a kill. Victory. Quite an epic cinematic finish as well. Round one. Realistic Jews, yet again. Orochi V Warlord. Timing of those attacks is very much on their movement, Round two. rather than the indicator, which of course we don't have. Not a bad start. Is he going to mix things up now? What's he going to do now? This could be mine if he's got hyper armor as well. He did that last time. Definitely that zone. It's more the way that he suddenly goes into that sort of crab pose. <laughs> or whatever it is. He like, do you know what I mean? He goes like with his arms to the left and right. Can't really explain it. Oh, I thought it was going to headbutt. Oh, he managed to get that off. 
Maybe it's that stamina. Just managed that. Close. Defeat. Come on. Can't lose this. Cannot lose it. He's definitely starting to mix things up. Round four. Although I'm surprised he managed to correctly predict and react. First of all. Called it. Round one. Realistic duels in the forest with Orochi versus Peacekeeper and no indicators. Let's go. me a bit inside to do that but we had to round two we almost got the deflect in the first instance Oh my god. <laughs> we have parried. Victory. We've parried a peacekeeper zone with no indicators. My job here is done. <laughs> I don't think Round three. there's anything more difficult than that. Or we could deflect a zone instead. <laughs> Jesus. That was pretty much prediction. Round one. Right, another realistic duel with Dark Orochi. And we've got Yomaganda. Oh, I almost had that. I was dodging that. Oh, right, sorry. It's down. Victory! We've combined the dragon emotes with the dark thing. What are you meant to do against the rage? Round two. Well, block. I'm not sure. He's got he's got unblockables, which we don't have. Ah, I'm not thinking. Damn. Defeat. I wasn't concentrating at the beginning. Screwed it up. Screwed it up. Round three. Come on then, Mr. Yomanganda. You with your massive hammer. Let's see what we can do. Deflect you. That's gonna parry us. You just gonna try and get out of stamina. Just deflect your zone, thank you. Any comments from him? Silence. Round four. Dark Orochi is regaining his power. <laughs> 
And I will have that. The lights deflect to finish you. Another realistic duel against a blue Zen Hu. Hey, that rhymes actually. Blue Zen Hu. Are you ready? Or zone. Ooh, almost had him. Victory! Mediocre start. Nothing too fancy. Round two. We need to work out how this guy plays. And then try and work out how to counter it whilst not trying to indicate this. Oh, I thought that was top. Oh, I keep thinking he's doing top, he's doing right. Victory! I guess it's quite difficult for them to parry those lights because there's not much tell in them. But then again, he's got lights like that as well, which Round three. are quite tricky because it's just like a poke animation. Let's try and spice things up. Zone. Oh, he didn't cancel that. That is Victory. the zone we were looking for. Deflect to finish on Zan Huzo. Round one. I just realised this guy's actually total rep 486 with a rep 53 Centurion. So this is going to be tricky. Let's not get hit by a wall. Oh my god, okay. That's a bad start. <laughs> No, not good. Underestimated this. Oh dear, someone's failed the kick. He's missing it. Oh, he gave him that. That's silly. I thought he might have guard broken me. Defeat. That's why he's picked Centurion, because the guard breaks are harder to see. Round two. We might have to play quite aggressively. Counteract that. It's not going to look pretty, but it might be the only way. Victory! Definitely not pretty. And now you're thinking, you know, deflects, etc. But he's a centurion. Round three. He can hold his heavies. Be really risky to go for deflects on this guy. <laughs> okay, we got one. That's that's about enough. Victory. I think. The uh, number of deflects for these matches are going to be reduced slightly Round four. for the Centurion. Okay, I'll have to go. That's about as much as we can do against a rep. Pretty much 500. Centurion with no indicators.